I'm Evelyn and I thank you for stopping by. Uh, I am a certified love attraction coach as well as an intentional creativity coach. And today I want to talk to you about the paradox of the manifestation process. I've, I've been pretty good in my life with manifesting uh, my dreams and what I want to experience uh as well as like physical things like i think i my husband and i my husband and i we learned um how to manifest um things together but that's that's going to be a topic for the next video uh the paradox of the manifestation process is first you need to have a vision you have your dream and you know what it looks like and how sometimes how it's going to happen. And it's very important to write down that vision and to write down as many details as you want because it helps you generate the feeling of having it already. You get into the how it's going to feel. It's going to be exciting. It's going to feel so uh, abundant and peaceful and filled with love or success. And, and yet you need to give it up. You need to uh, let it go, let go of the vision because at some point in between, the dream and the excitement and the manifestation of it, you, um, if you keep the vision, you will be constantly reminded that it's not here yet. So you need to give up the vision and to, and to connect with the knowing that it's coming and that, um, and, and that everything is, is, uh, happening behind the scenes so you can't see it for your dream to happen and the other piece of it is that if you're too attached to your vision you wouldn't see your dream coming into your life if it looked a different way so we so what you want to do is yes you want to describe it and to generate the feeling and then you you let it go be, knowing that uh it's happening it's on its way it is it and in between you know now and then you um you take care of how you, you feel and how you want to feel so you find uh ways to uh feel happy and um fulfilled and that's and that's the challenge that's the challenge and i i realize that you know because we're confronted with our reality um but that's a topic for another video it's um yeah i won't go into details here today i just wanted to talk about the paradox of manifesting, where the vision is important and then you have to let go of the vision. Um, so what do you think? <laughs> what is your experience with manifestation? I would love to hear. And then next, in the next video, I will share how to manifest with someone who dreams differently than you. You might have the same dream, but it seems like it, it's kind of different. For example, my husband and I, we bought many houses and, um, and we dream very differently. So our list and our vision was very, very different. So I'll tell you more next time I see you, but I found how it works. I found out <laughs> and I'll share with you what I found out. So thank you for stopping by and I would love to hear from you. If you want to hear more from me, subscribe and oh, look at the sun. <laughs> ah, shiny. 
anyways i'm gonna let you go <laughs> bye